I'm the Marquis, but you can call me Martin. And welcome back to my second reaction to Poets of the Fall. Uh, with the new song from 2020, Requiem for my Harley Quinn. Last time I've watched their popular song, of course, Carnival of Was, and was immediately hooked. I checked out uh, a live performance of the song, and yeah, live, the live sounds freaking amazing. So yeah, this is the new song for the game Control. They make two songs, I believe, and this was the first things I checked out. And after that, I watched Carnival of Worst. So let's check it out. Ooh. Already completely different vibe. This is a requiem for the Harlequin, the great pretender crashing down with style. Here's to the fall of man, fame to dust, fortune to sand. The great surrender finally arrived. This is our requiem.
It's so incredible. Last time, Carnival of, of Was, and now this, the new song, even though the sound is different, but the vibe, the atmosphere, the ha the distance have changed. And this is a thing you don't have a lot, by a lot of bands, that you can say they have the same feel from this song to that song. Even if it's more heavier, more rocky, doesn't matter. It's this yeah, poet, really, this poetic way and the dreamy, a little bit, uh, the gothic aesthetic, um, the darkness, uh, you know, in this lyrics, in the songs. Oh, and what amazing song! The guitar solo, the 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 what this this walking beat, this, and the the orchestra. They're so underrated. I mean, the song has a million views, uh, and they have some subscribers, but still. I haven't heard or seen a lot of people reacting to Pearls of the Fall uh, or talking about them and I don't even know if they were in some festivals before. Now I'm freaking glad I finally found them. I found a band where I can say I am will become a fan. They have all the vibes, all the sounds, all the elements I love, enjoy in music and also the videos. The, 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 you know, this is really... The name fits the fur the fits the perfectly poets because all their songs have some are so deep and you can interpret it in different ways uh, with Harley Quinn and uh, in the end how uh, he sees in the mirror himself without the makeup so like a little bit like yeah becoming yourself or take off the mask you know and be yourself or something. <laughs> this is just my, for me, it was it's always when something is like taking off the makeup or taking off the m something and you see how we look like, it's like taking off the mask and now that's how I am and or what I is, um, be myself or whatever. <laughs> Don't hide anymore uh, behind the mask. But it's just uh, how I feel it um, from the cinema graphic. Uh, I also think, um, as I'm a musician and music lover, the first thing I've, when I listen to music, is enjoying the music. I listen to the instruments, and the voice is the instruments. And oh, and when I hear, yeah, well, perfectly. Then after that, I go to the lyrics. Sometimes I catch the lyrics, but for me, the first important part is the entire thing, the vibe, um, the sound, and then going deeper into it. But this was good. This was good. Waking from a Harlequin from last year, when you also like what you've heard, please check out Poets of the Fall and especially show them to other people. Um, yeah, because they will become probably one of my favorite rock bands that try different things but always have their vibe they want to do. And that's good. So thank you very much for watching, for attention, and we see us definitely to other parts of the fall action. Until then, goodbye.